wow, this thing just failed. Um, I just did like a whole bunch of stuff and I didn't even save it. But um, anyways, uh, I'm just gonna show you guys like what you have to do to you know get past the part. So it ends up you have to push the bear or push this little pot over to there and it'll activate this bridge. Once the bridge is activated, um, to get to this you have to first push this one, like push this one right there, and then and then you have to be in here. Like you have to, you have to push this one. You have to go like, hold on. You have to push this one out, and then push this one in. Push this one in, and then while this one is out, you have to pull it out again, and then push it in. Or pull it in like that, and then the chest will be there. Well, if you don't do that, the chest won't be there. And once you open the chest, you get a key. So, with that key, wow, the bridge was there. Oh my gosh. With that key, you have to go over here, go back to where you were before. Alright, there's a chest up there. All it has in there is a dungeon map. So, there's that. Um, so, with that key, you just simply get in this barrel and run this way and while you're running there will be another door so you just go through there that won't be open but it is for me because i got farther and it wasn't recording but um then what you do is you just come up here go through here and simply just jump off of there so and that should take you to here and down these stairs is i'll show you guys that was a compass, and then over here is a chest, but there's no way of getting it yet, so we'll have to wait before we get that. And through here leads to these guys. There will be four guys that appear around you. Um, I tried killing them all to get the key to that door up there. There's a door up there, but uh, it doesn't work. And then that door, next to that door, is it just leads you to a spider web that you can't break, so... I'm guessing you have to go back through here. Alright, now that all the reenacting is done, <laughs> I can show you guys. Um, I guess you have to go through here, and something over here you have to do to get the key. Okay, so I, that activates that, which you can pull back this and get across. Alright, so yeah, I think we're on the right track here. It's got nothing in these vases. Yeah, nothing in them, so whatever. Um, let's kill these guys. I don't really know what what that's for. Oh wow, there's a lot of these things. Um. Okay, yeah, that's what I figured. So let's just push that over there. And push this onto that switch. So there we go. I don't know why they put two. I guess so it'll confuse you. Uh, mini boss battle, I guess. Like mini little thing. You just have to kill these three guys. Very simple, easy. At least that's all I think you have to do. Yeah, and then there's the key. All right, so here's the key that you need to use to open that door. So let's hope it works. Um, well, of course it's gonna work. <laughs> so, just come out here, go up these stairs, and jump off this edge right here. And once you're through, go through here, and take the door on the left. Oh yeah, this door, that's what you use the key on, I think, to open that door. No, I don't know, I'm, I can't really remember. But, um, okay, so here's the door over here. Stupid smoke is so annoying. Like, this stuff that they drop. Alright, so let's open the door and go through and in here oh here see that's what that door led there's a there's like a spider web in the way so I guess this is the boss battle oh wow oh that's easy oh crap whoa 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 ho calm down calm down calm down calm down dang this boss is strange it's actually kind of fun a good little mini boss. Well, at least I think it's a mini boss. It might be the full boss. I don't know. It's pretty cool. I'm glad to be playing a Zelda game that I haven't already played or beaten. Alright, so. There we go. 
now let's just simply open this up. And you got the gush jar. So hold the button to draw things in and release it to fire them out. Set A or B on the item screen to use it. So I don't know where the item screen is. They probably should have told you where that was. I guess that's it. And there we go. I don't really use the shield anyways, so... Oh, that's cool. Oh, look at that. That's cool. Okay, so... Now using this... I think there's something hidden in here. I don't even know. Whatever. Um, Let's just pull these spider webs off of there. Something new. This is pretty cool. Um, So, as you can see, we have to go through here. And there's the heart piece. Yes! Alright, so I now have two of four heart pieces. Which is really good. Um... All I need is two more, and then I got another heart. Even though after you beat this dungeon, I'm pretty sure you get a heart piece, like in all the other Zelda games. So, now with this gun, we can take this spider web off. And uh, I'll show you guys where this leads in the next video. So, thanks for watching, and bye.